Welcome back all my Minecrafting friends. This is the announcement video for the March 2015 Minecraft Hardcore Challenge. And before I tell you which challenge it is, because I want to prolong the suspense as long as possible, let me go over the standard rules. All standard rules apply this month. That includes no harming passive mobs. This includes any kind of passive mob, not just food animals. It includes bats, it includes squids, it includes, uh, you know, donkeys, uh, whatever. If it's, a, if it's a mob that's not attacking you and, and doesn't attack you when you hit it, then you can't attack it. You can't hurt it, you can't push it off a cliff, you can't build a machine to, you know, to harm it in any way. Okay. Uh... No sleeping in beds, of course. Uh, no AFK crop growth. Uh, AFK crop growth means uh, away from keyboard. It means uh, between episodes. Like if you if you finish episode two and you sign off, and you've just I mean at the end of episode two you just planted your your wheat seeds, and then uh, when you sign in. Uh, the beginning of episode 3 and start your recording all your wheat seeds have magically grown this is against the rules uh, all your crop growth has to be uh, you know during your recording time not in between recordings and uh, your recordings should be one minecraft day and night approximately 20 minutes 20 minutes uh, assuming you don't have too much lag that would slow it down make it longer and uh, okay, no alternate world exploration. That means don't load the seed up in a creative world and uh, find out where the diamonds are or anything else, and then go back into your game world and and go directly to it. It does not mean you can't go to the Nether. You can still go to the Nether. Everything should be on camera and at normal speed, so no speed ups, no uh, saying, okay, well, I'll stop the recording now and, and do all this mining and get back to you in a, in a second. None of that. Everything has to be on camera and at normal speed. Okay? That doesn't mean that you can't take a break and go to the bathroom, but, you know, make sure you stop your game, stop your recording, and go do your business, come back restart your game and restart your recording and you're good to go okay brightness levels uh, I hate to watch a video when the brightness is set on moody because it makes it really hard for me to see what's going on uh, so set your brightness at a hundred percent please and do not set your brightness above a hundred percent because that is cheating uh, that's would require editing a file or using a mod. So, brightness at 100%, not above 100%. Okay, this is vanilla Minecraft, no mods, although Batty's mod is, is okay. Current version, which is currently 1.8.3, as you can see in the corner of the screen there. We're playing in hardcore mode, which means uh, once you die, you're, you're out of the game unless it's day zero nobody dies on day zero so if you die on day zero just restart okay generate structures will be off so we will not have any of those pesky villages or abandoned mine shafts or temples they just get in the way anyway uh, we're going to use large biomes so whatever biome we we log into uh, is going to be a large one March has nine Mondays and Fridays, five Mondays and four Fridays, so there will be nine episodes in March. Uh, post them on Mondays and Fridays, uh, plus or minus one day. You can post it a day early, or you can post it up to like half a day after. Like, you can post it on Sunday or Thursday, or Monday or Friday, or uh, until noon on Tuesday or until noon on Saturday and it will still uh, probably make it into the update video the 
the player updates. Uh, the player updates. Okay, so you can uh, you can name your videos uh, day zero through day eight, or you can name them episode one through episode nine. Your choice, whatever you prefer. Uh, the update, the player updates will be titled day zero through day eight. Okay, so let's. I think that covers all the standard stuff. And oh, if you're playing in a team and one of your team members dies, you need to make them a gravestone the next episode, or a little gravesite or something, to acknowledge their their passing. Okay create a new world and we're gonna call the world well I'm gonna call mine you can call yours whatever you want uh, March 2015 MHC okay we're gonna be in hardcore mode uh, generate structures are gonna be off world type large biomes and the seed is going to be the Zero Chunk Challenge. Okay, everything looks like it's spelled right. Let's take a look at the world so that we can all make sure that we're in the correct world and nothing went wrong, such as spelling or uh, versions or whatever downloading terrain okay white background black background oh and here we are in a tree okay Oh look, chicken. You can't kill him, but you can pick up his eggs. Okay, now, uh, in the Zero Chunk Challenge, there's only one special rule, okay? And that rule is that you cannot place anything outside of the coordinates of plus or minus 16 in the X and the Z. So, Anything means uh, any kind of blocks, any kind of stuff, uh, crafting tables, torches, water blocks, uh, anything, whoa, look at there, fire, uh, anything that you can place, okay, you cannot place outside of the coordinates of plus or minus 16. Now, it doesn't apply to the, to the Y, you can, you can all the way up to the top, all the way down to, you know, bedrock. From from bedrock to bedrock. Okay, you can place anything you want inside those zero chunks. Uh, a chunk, as you know, is 16 by 16, and the zero chunks are the four chunks that border the zero zero point. Now you will not be spawning at zero zero, so you'll be spawning at somewhere around 100 and 250. So, you probably should proceed to zero zero as soon as possible because that's the only place you can throw down a crafting table and make tools and stuff. Uh, so, you probably want to do that first. Although you can collect wood as long as you don't make any tools. Whoa, chicken just burned up over there. That tree's completely gone. All right. That lava probably hit the base of the tree. Anyway, so you can't place anything outside of uh, the spawn chunks, I mean the zero chunks. Okay, and that includes the nether. So when you go into the nether and you check the nether coordinates, uh, you can't place any blocks outside of plus or minus 16 in the X and the Z. Now, you can go outside of plus or minus 16. You can go anywhere you want. You can break any block anywhere you want. You just can't place any blocks. This means no torches, no placing blocks to pillar up, no uh, 
placing stairs or steps or or blocks to jump on to get out of a hole if you're in a hole and you need to get out you are going to have to uh, dig your way out diagonally or something okay and you see that cow you can't hurt that cow either you can milk him but you can't uh, harm him okay let me think if I've covered everything I do believe I've covered everything. Okay, so good luck. Uh, don't starve. Uh, try not to spend too much time watching wheat grow. Uh, you know, see if you can find more interesting things to do. Uh, find different stuff to eat. And uh, hopefully, we all we all learn something new this month. Although I'm not really sure what that would be yet. But this is going to be a difficult one to survive. So I think uh, just surviving is going to be quite an accomplishment. And if you can build something uh, relatively comfortable and, and nice in your in your zero chunks, you know, that, that would be a bonus. Okay. So uh, if you have any questions, put them in the comments. And if you're planning on playing, put that in the comments. And uh, I hope to see you all in March. This is Mike Deering signing out.